me to smile behind my mask. How long will it last? Stimulus going fast. Government won't act. How long will this be going uh, on? To the Sky Girl, so progressive with FNN, Feminist News Network, and Feminist News. That's right for you. Welcome to Sky Inn, the Abba Pui Room, giving you that soulful news you need. Yes, indeed. And if you haven't told a friend to like and subscribe and get that soulful news, that soulful way. Well, if you haven't told a friend to like, If you haven't told a friend to like and subscribe and get that soulful news, that soulful weight, well, baby, you better let them know they can get it today. Now, what is it I'm going to talk to you about? What is going on? Remember, like and subscribe. Check out the videos. I'm predicting all over the place. But I know I already predicted this. So we're going to talk about it. Who? Lloyd Austin. You're like, who in the hell is all that Austin? That black man that's playing identity politics that got a special exception because he is not civilian being over the Secretary of Defense. Our new Secretary of Defense, Lloyd Austin, who did what? Hinkle let it out. A lot of us knew Biden approved it, of course, because he picked them. The warmongering is back on. And not just warmongering, war profiteering. Let me read you what was put down. And then we really gonna clam. It's a hot mess. Let me read it. From uh, Jackson Hinkle, as uh, shown on Reacted Tonight with uh, Lee Camp, Biden just approved an $85 million dollar Raytheon's weapons deal for Chile. Biden's Secretary of Defense, O'Loy, was a Raytheon board member prior to his joining the administration and still owns between 500000 and $1.7 million in Raytheon stocks. This should be illegal. Honey, it is. I dare you to find somebody to get them. Mm -hmm. I know you heard that. 85 freaking million. And he has almost a, between 500,000 to a million in stock. Do you even have a guess about that? This is why we needed a civilian. This is why we don't do this. Because he's profiting and giving to Raytheon. I guess you ain't going to hear about Boeing because Raytheon's going to get everything. Yes, it is illegal. Yes, something needs to be done. And yes, we need to be questioning why Biden approved. Why does he want to help those companies make money? How much did they give to his campaign? To the point to where he got a hire this guy. Mm -hmm. Something doesn't smell right in the Pentagon. And is this on CNN? Is this all over the news? Is everybody talking about it? Did you hear about this on the Hill? Not even democracy now. Not even all the other news. Identity politics. His wartime blue.
this is ugly. I told you this up. Man was going to do this. I had to hold back on what I wanted to say. You know, an elite black man like that will sell not only his own brother out like the people that were against reparations in that hearing the other day, but they'll sell the world out and destroy it. Because of somebody that didn't treat them right as a child. This is what happens when we have a whole generation of um, just children of alcoholics and abuse. Because we never supplied our economy or treated our people well. Don't let me get too deep. But what you can do is say, what is Congress going to do? Are they going to stand by and be silent? Are they going to say anything and stand up and not go for this and call it illegal and say this shouldn't be happening? Leave the comments below and let me know at feministnewsand at gmail.com. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the YouTube channel and the Facebook page. And remember, I'm not so progress. One on Twitter, on the Feminist News Network on Twitter now. I got that rant of the day on Blogger. I need to uh, update my Patreon, so don't worry about that just yet. I'll let you know when it's back up. But I got the Venmo. PayPal me me up. Hit me up and I will go ahead and let you know. Yes, indeed. But I got the links below in case you want to donate. Thank you very much in advance. You know, we're small, growing. Catch me without commercials because I'm going to try to be the station that's progressive. We're not going to be the ones to have commercials. And we're going to stay on top of what rocks and what affects women around the world. Like the ones from Chile that rather see that money go toward helping its people than buying more defense weapons to hold and oppress their indigenous and poor populations of that nation. So remember, in this era of hate, you better participate. Because if you don't, more countries will suffer from dictatorships that are buying weapons from the U.S. state while they play identity politics all over the place, but property. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining. Peace. See the smile behind my mask. How long will it last? Stimulus going fast. Government won't act. How long? Will this be going on? I'm standing here in 